In this video, I'm going to try to explain how to predict the weather, giving you an insight on cloud formations, warm fronts, cold fronts, weather folklore, and science in nature. When I started to read about clouds and weather prediction, I found out that the articles that I read were pretty complicated and was not easy to absorb. So I decided to make a video about it. Let's start off with clouds. There are high-level clouds formed out of ice crystals, and they are at the height of 6,000 meters. There are middle-level clouds formed out of water and ice and are at a height between 2,000 and 6,000 meters. And there are low-level clouds formed out of water. And the low-level clouds are at a height of 2,000 meters and below. So in this picture, you can see all types of clouds. I will start off from the high-level clouds and work my way down. Let's have a look at these two animations. Cold fronts move faster than warm fronts, bringing in more radical weather changement. Cumulus clouds are a good indicator of a cold front. If the circumstances are right, at the collision point of a cold front on a warm front, thunder clouds can appear. Warm fronts move slower than cold fronts. A good indicator are cirrus clouds. The cirrus clouds can be seen miles away. As it moves, the rain comes closer, bringing in long-lasting rain periods. Cirrus cloud means fair weather and a good indicator that a warm front is on its way. Cyrocumulus means fair weather as the warm front approaches closer. Cyrostratus means rain in 12 hours or faster, depending on the movement of the front. Also, cumulus clouds mean fair weather but a change is on its way in 12 to 36 hours. If alto cumulus grow in height, thunderstorms can appear. Alto stratus means light drizzling rain. If the rain becomes more severe, the clouds can form into nimbo stratus. Cumulus clouds means fair weather and a cold front indicator, but if the cumulus clouds move closer to each other and develop in height, they can produce heavy showers. Stratocumulus means light showers and usually disappear after a few hours. Nimbo stratus means rain and usually rains for a great length of time. Stratus means light drizzling rain and long gray skies. Cumulonimbus means thunderstorms, heavy winds and rain. So now that we have a basic understanding of clouds and warm and cold fronts, let's move on to weather folklore. Remembering the clouds. High level clouds start off with C, I, Cyrus, Cyrocumulus, Cyrostratus. Middle level clouds start off with Alto, Altocumulus, and Altostratus. The hard part is remembering the low level clouds Cumulus, Stratocumulus, Nimbostratus, Stratus, and Cumulonimbus. Ten clouds is not a high number, right? Learning how to recognize them and the changes that they bring with them gives you an insight about what's to come. I'm going to finish this video with science in nature that will help you to predict the weather. Mm -hmm. 